What is up guys, this is Kai Blackflame and welcome back to Grand Blue Fantasy. And today we're gonna be doing the raid event on Boots and Blades. In an attempt to get more get some loot while at the same time get more tokens in order to have more draw draws to get the exclusive summon Drook or Druge or Drew, whatever whatever you pronounce it. Anyway, for those that uh, want a quick summary of the story in this event is that there are these two people, they're called Stan and Alyssa, they... One is a weapons expert, the other one is a martial artist, and they have been training together for... for many years according to them. And right now they're starting to develop feelings for each other and they needed the player's help to play Cupid, you know, to give them an incentive to, to hook up. Anyway, drama happens, stuff happens, you fight bosses, and in the end they get together. So anyway, we're gonna jump into one of the raids, see if we can find one. Oh, and there seems to be a Druge raid right now. Alright, let's do this. We're gonna go with Odin. Uh, hopefully this raid doesn't fill up pretty good because raids tend to fill. Alright, let's... let's start spamming skills. Combo, combo, yes. Alright, that got some damage in. Yep, the raid is filling up pretty quickly. That is the problem with raids that once it's an important boss, they tend to fill up pretty quickly and with the sheer amount of damage that everyone is dealing, the boss tends to get taken down pretty quickly, which I consider a problem for this game. Like, the bosses should be a bit more durable. Just like, no, it's going to... yep, it just died. <laughs> Yay, more loot. Alright, let's see if we can find one for the other boss. Which is Katopnes. And I think I can host one. Because I do remember having a lot of monster jars. Monster jars. Yep, I do. So yeah, I'm gonna... let's host one. Since they're just collecting dust anyway. So might as well use them. Alright, so who am I going with? Let's go with a bot friend Bahamut. Calling in everybody. <laughs> Oh god. Oh, he 
enemies arrived. Mm. Oh shit, debuff. I only have one heal. Yeah, MC is dying, so... Pop that heal. And since he's in overdrive, I can do this. This boss is an overdrive, you gotta be careful because there's a lot of AoE in this. Like that. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, damn it. Hmm. Uh, let's see, Stan. Oh, I died. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of loot. Oh wow! The, oh wow! He got a, got a lot of loyalty from that one. Zoria is sixty three, so might as well finish him. I think I have four, so if I had one more scale, I could host a uh, Drew. Yeah, I think you need five. Oh no, it's three. Okay, we can host a Drew. Yeah, let's host a Drew. So let's see what I use. Uh, crap. 60% boost of Dark Alice, 20% to all HP. Okay, I think I'll go with Olivia. You know, with the party that I have, I guess Olivia will be an optimal summon for me. Fast. Yep, damn, that was. That was fast. Ah, oh, no gold this time? Funny, usually when I host a room, I get silver chests. But when I join a raid, I get gold chests. I don't understand <laughs> how the loot system works. I got more gold medals. Yay, achievement! Hmm. Oh, the ending. Mm, I'll look it up later. Let's. Alright, so 20 tokens. Alright, so let's see if we can get the summon. Let's start the draw.
Yes, class points are a necessity. Cause I spent all of my class points just to unlock the fencer. Oh yes, I think we got him. Yes, we got him. It's rainbow. Cause Drew is the only rainbow, the only SSR in, in the event pool. Oh, there he is. Boom, there he is. Got him. <laughs> we did it guys, we got an event summon. This is the first one. Let's have a look at you. As of light, then. Yeah, from what I've been told, he is pretty good from early game to mid game. But the downside to him is that if you put what the what it hit, the problem with Drew is his passive, which is it pretty much cuts your defenses, which makes you very squishy in harder dungeons. When there are other summons that give you more boosts in light element, yet you don't get any drawbacks in the in return. So, on the end game level, I would not recommend them, but if you just started playing this game, I guess, and this is like the only thing you can muster up, then yes, use Drew. Mm -hmm. But if you have anything better, then use that. Alright, so we still got plenty of tokens, so let's just spend them all. Summon fodder, summon fodder for days. Oh, crystal, okay. Oh. It's either... An SR EXP weapon or an XR Angel or Drew. Oh wait, I forgot the Tyrant weapons. All right, Tyrant bow. Uh, well, we got one of the Tyrant weapons. Yeah, but I'm still missing the. I'm still missing the other one. Alright, let's keep drawing. RNG too strong! RNG too strong! But at least I'm getting a lot of goodies out of this. I think we might get a Tyrant weapon. Or an EXP fodder. Let's see what we got. Uh huh, we got the other one. That's all of them. We got the whole set. Yep, we got the whole set. I wonder what happens if we get everything available from from this because apparently there's still more stuff to draw. Like I wonder what happens if I get everything. I think it's not. Well, if it's 0 out of 1, then that means I can't get multiple drills. Which is fine. And 
I seem to have gotten delays. Okay, here we go. Very stone. All right, XP. Yep, we we can do two more ten draws. Oh, excuse me. Oh, there's still plenty of other stuff to get. Anyway, let's see what we get. Yay, more stuff. I know a certain someone that likes free stuff. Alright, let's have a look at the event Alright, wait, where's the event page in this? Alright, let's go to the menu, let's go to this one. It's gonna pick up the load. Two more tendros now. All I know is that I'm, I'm gonna be leveling up a bunch of stuff <laughs> after I, I'm done posting this video. There is three more Archangel weapons and still plenty of angel weapons. And a bunch of more of the rest of the stuff. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.